boy in this question they say uh, you could have one e one n or both being same two e two n right you are choosing um, four letters from the ten letter here so if you already place one e and another e and one n and another n here that's it this is the only way you can do this that's the meaning of only one way i take the e i place it here it's only one way of doing it I have no choice for the spaces and the question is asking about selection so we don't need to uh, jumble them up when you are doing for this case that's when you have to be careful you already place one e and one n right and then you have two more blank spaces to fill up this is the numbers of letters that you are left to choose from so to fill up this space you have six letter and then just choose two to fill up the space. Two empty spaces, two letters. Out of the six, choose two. That's all. You don't have to divide by n, divide by two factorial. This is not an arrangement question. You don't have to do over some factorial. It doesn't work like that. The idea is simple. You just go and delete off the e and the n. The balance number will become the six. So out of it, you choose two spaces like that. 